So I got into entrepreneurship uh, probably for all the wrong reasons. I was a consultant and somehow I got assigned to do a study on how self-made billionaires had uh, formed their careers. And so I got eight weeks to study that question. And what I learned is that uh, they never do it by working for someone else. They always own a company. And so I became interested in the idea of starting a company. Uh, and the other thing was that I had a great love of technology and Star Trek and I wanted to help create the future. So I got into entrepreneurship to be part of startups for that reason. Then, um, maybe six years into my first startup, it began to have a lot of problems. And it was clear that uh, it wasn't going to be a great money maker anytime soon. And I had to decide why I really wanted to do it or I should go switch to another career. And in the end, I decided the second part, that the bringing of the new technology to people. This was e-ink, it was electronic paper, it was an entire library in the palm of your hand. It was a beautiful technology. And I decided it was too important not to continue. And so I stayed in entrepreneurship. Uh, because it was important for humanity as I saw it. So I've been in EIR for the past three years. I've met with 70, 80 at least uh, different people trying to start companies. I tend to uh, be very interested in formation, how uh, teams can come together, how they should award their equity to each other, how to find out if the market is real or not, uh, also how to find out if the technology is real or not and um, going out for that first capital raise. These are all things that uh, I, I like and uh, have some advice to give. I think for the students, it's important to be a good listener and find out what their dreams are, sort of tease that out of the conversation and help them attain what, what their inner goals are that they're trying to accomplish and make sure that the business that they're designing, which has a lot of options in terms of product, business model, amount of capital raised, risk, time frame, try to pick those options so that they all fit together in a way that's going to give them the best chance of accomplishing what their real inner mission is.